Planet Earth is warming up quickly as a result of human activities, mainly the burning of fossil fuels. Examples of fossil fuels are coal, oil, and natural gas. Humans depend on fossil fuels for transportation, heating, and electricity. The onset of the Industrial Revolution in the 18th century saw a boom in manufacturing worldwide. Factories were created and mass production began. So too did the burning of fossil fuels to run those factories. Our dependence on fossil fuels has continued to grow along with our population. As we burn fossil fuels, they release greenhouse gases that trap in heat. The major gases produced by humans are carbon dioxide and methane. Landfills and the meat industry create enormous amounts of methane every year. As vegetation breaks down, it releases methane. This is why those landfills create so much every year. Also, when vegetation is digested through cows and pigs, methane is released. The size of farms has grown over the past 100 years, and this is why the meat industry is responsible for producing tons of methane. With that being said, the greenhouse gas that is the leading contributor to climate change is carbon dioxide. By volume, carbon dioxide accounts for more than half of the greenhouse gases produced by humans. The primary way Canadians emit carbon dioxide is through the use of transportation. Prior to the Industrial Revolution, carbon was at a stable level for thousands of years, approximately 280 parts per million. Right now, the amount of carbon in our atmosphere is above 400 parts per million. Once released into the atmosphere, some greenhouse gases may remain there for a couple hundred years. That means that the fossil fuels our great-grandparents burned are still warming up planet Earth today. When greenhouse gases are at a stable level, this is a good thing as they help keep the planet warm. This can be explained through what is known as the greenhouse effect. The sun's rays shine down on our planet and some of this heat and radiation is absorbed by various surfaces on Earth. Some of those rays are reflected off of the Earth's surface and the greenhouse gases in the atmosphere trap this heat and radiation. In fact, without these greenhouse gases, our average earthly temperature would fall from 18 degrees Celsius to negative 15 degrees Celsius. The problem is that for the last approximately 150 years, we have been burning fossil fuels at a very high rate. Thus, the amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere has increased by about 40% thereby trapping more heat and warming up the planet. Imagine you've parked the car for a few hours on a hot day. When you return to the car and open up the door, it's really hot in there. This is a lot like what is happening on Earth. So basically, we're enhancing the greenhouse effect. We humans are damaging our environment in a big way. So what does that really mean? 